I had to struggle. I struggled with it for a while because yeah. you try to find meaning, we and you're did. like, if I'm temporary and this isn't forever, what's it matter if I do anything? And the thing that, like, the the answer I arrived to was that I'm a piece of all of it. Mm-hmm. You know, even though it's temporary, what I am is the whole thing. That that's what I actually am. I'm looking at it from like this little peephole, you know. From a very small little like viewfinder into like this this universe, but there's no line. If I'm, you know, the the reality is I am just a meat machine. You know, there isn't some innate separate part of me. I'm connected to all of it. I'm ex- I'm an extension of all of it, and and I have extensions of all of it through me. Like think of all the cells in my body that are, live autonomously. Like, think about the skin cells that, that behave, that, that the have flora. their own, yeah, the flora, the bacteria, uh, every, almost every part of me is a separate living thing that all thinks they're probably their own thing. And I'm not anything except the collection of all of them together. And somehow when you get them all together and they're all working, that makes me think that I'm separate from all of it. When at the whole time, I was it. I was it. It's like it's like a bubble on the ocean. And when the bubble bursts, that bubble is gone forever. But it becomes the ocean. It just becomes it merges back into that. And it'll pop up other bubbles. And and each bubble kind of thinks it's temporary and thinks important. it's the old, it thinks it it's important. Thinks it, it matters. And it does and it doesn't. And each bubble is part of the whole thing. Each bubble is the ocean.